so much. In this strangely peaceful situation, my heart starts to race. Taekwondo, an international IOC recognized martial arts. In its birthplace, Korea, Taekwondo has a special significance. All Koreans have at least once in their lives experienced Taekwondo as a form of artistic performance or as a part of their daily physical training. In Korea, Taekwondo is not merely martial art, but a precious tradition and a way of life. I feel the spirit of Taekwondo in everything I see here. In the heart of the 21st century dynamic Korea, you can feel the air of tradition and the fragrance of culture. A modern, high-tech commercial and financial district coexisting with beautiful ancient palaces, declared World Heritage by the UNESCO. That is a common sight in Korea. It is also a testimony of how the Korean people are able to intimately associate their spiritual culture with material civilization, making progress while not forgetting their ancient culture. The Gukiwon is a national and international center for Taekwondo. All year round, Taekwondo practitioners from all over the world gather here to learn and to teach. Experts carry out exchanges of technical studies and trainees receive recognition of the results of their individual learning efforts by means of examinations which lead to degrees of promotion. As a kind of mecca of Taekwondo, the World Taekwondo Headquarters symbolizes the harmony, solidarity, and progress of Taekwondo practitioners worldwide. The master says that everything depends on the mind. I am setting out on the path in search of my soul. This is the beginning of a quest for my identity within my own soul. A year-round program of temple stays is held in more than 40 Buddhist temples all over the country, offering participants the opportunity to experience traditional Korean Buddhist practices in the form of spiritual and physical exercises. In the quiet tranquility of mountain retreats far from our everyday world, these programs also offer the possibility of experiencing interesting activities such as the 108 prostration, ceremonial services, Zen meditation, relaxation, the tea ceremony, rubbings, Zen exercises, or lotus lantern making. In this place, even eating is a kind of spiritual training. I begin to understand how to abandon my own self. Temple stays can provide participants with a precious moment in which they can reflect upon their identities forgotten through everyday life. For those who want to know more about Taekwondo, the experience of Songwon Mu, an ancient Korean martial art, is a very good way. Son Guan Mu integrates body and soul to its training, incorporating simple and pure movements as the profound essence of martial arts. 
In Zen meditation, the mind is appeased and emptied and our physical posture is straightened. Zen meditation exercises where participants can experience oriental spiritual culture not only through the intellect, but by feeling and practicing it with their minds and bodies. It's a slow process, understanding, and then all of a sudden you get it. This will remain a memorable moment in my mind and body. Being here just one day gives me energy for a whole year. I will cherish this in my mind. In the fierce competition of modern life, without realizing it, I lost the image of my own self. A spiritual journey to a land of mystery, Korea, in a search of my own image. For people in need of an answer to life, the practice of Taekwondo and the experience of Temple Stay provide an important source of insight. What I have comprehended here. I hope not to forget so easily. Mind and body are not separate things. The most precious thing I forgot was my own self. Here. Here. I, I discovered discover the, the way. way.